Let's turn now to the frankly disturbing news from the Centers for Disease Control late today. A drug-resistant superbug that the medical community has long feared now found in the United States. Doctors confirm the strain in a Pennsylvania woman and say this could mean the end of the road for antibiotics as we know them. NBC's Miguel Almaguer has what you need to know. The alarming discovery by researchers, the ultimate superbug doctors have long feared. A bacteria now confirmed in the U.S. resistant to antibiotics, including colicin, the powerful antibiotic of last resort. It's almost impossible to treat, and we certainly don't want more of that. The potentially deadly superbug discovered seven months ago in pigs and a small number of people in China was eventually found in Europe, Africa, and Canada before being detected in America. The 49-year-old Pennsylvania woman, whose urine tested positive for the bacteria, never traveled out of the U.S. She's now consulting with the CDC. While federal officials say this nightmare bacteria is dangerous, for now it is not widespread. But they say this is a reminder to doctors about the dangers of overprescribing antibiotics. According to some studies, 30% of outpatient antibiotic prescriptions are unnecessary. 47 million prescriptions each year. The concern antibiotics are so overly prescribed, superbugs are growing immune to them. The medicine cabinet is empty for some patients. It is the end of the road for antibiotics unless we act urgently. Tonight, confirmation the superbug officials have been dreading is now here. Miguel Almaguer, NBC News, Los Angeles. Hey, NBC News fans, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking on that button down here and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives. Thanks for watching.